Base truck fills off, lines are out. Flag getting ready to drop to the 6M of Madison Reed and he quickly drops back. Little bit crazy. Yo, yo, yo. It's too slick yet, guys. We're gonna roll the track small. Roll it on the top. Keep your speed up and yes. roll on the top. Then you also have the E3 of Ed Jasper, the 86 of Kirk Bonin still. So we'll try it again. Definitely hoping for different results. Better results and everybody staying on the track, hopefully. Hughes and Honus get uh, into each other, get a little bit sideways. Reed moves up, is a little bit slower than what we saw these guys going in the heat races. But way out front, all alone, jumping into zero. Honus already moving his way up into first place. Herzog gets in. It's a bit of a bumper car rally right now. Herzog doesn't get in into each other. Honus, no problem. Really no problems for uh, Champin either. You see the car sliding up there in one and two. Problems for the 19-H. Honus well out front, finding his way around the turn pretty good. Jasper finds the inside panel of the 20 of Sauter. They still keep going straight. That's the important thing as Lockdale and McNabb also get together. I think maybe the bump is actually keeping a few on the track. This is a 12 lap feed for 19 8 Thomas still your leader. Things champion now you see the battle for a third three cars between the 17S of Smith, the 9H of Herzog, and the 14M of McNabb. Herzog getting on the inside of Smith takes over a third. Now McNabb tries to Dive in front of the 17S on the inside. He's going to slide it up in front of Michael. Now Smith's going to look on the inside of both Herzog and McNabb. Honus still, meanwhile, leads, and Chapman still runs second. McNabb now third. And again, race fans, for your safety, we ask that you do stay away from the fence during all races this evening. Home is now into lap traffic. Home gets around to Earl for more open track. And Fawn still back to his side for the rabbit. Fawn going into three short. on the back Contact, stretch, that's on the bottom. Honus wanted to see, but that's what, something that the zero. It's a top or bottom, second with fourth, second with, same with sixth. We can get him back, bumped up to look and try to find themselves a good run on the restart, but the 19-H has a good run. He's a little high in one and two. He's going to slow him down a little bit, Chapin. 
Brings up a little ground. We do have a call on the back. Looks like it's Hughes in the 18-H there in turn one. So that's going to bring back the pass. Here the turn one. we'll restart them on the and reline them back up. Sliding and, well, even just some of the bumper car action that was going on in the early laps as the cars are getting adjusted to the new track. And to get some water. So here we are back, 19H, another good jump. This time stays a little lower on turn two. Doesn't get slowed down. And now Smith making the run on the inside of McNabb. He's just about going three wide with uh, Chapman up top in the zero. But we'll have another caution with debris all over the turns three. All right, so we're back, and we're back. We're looking at the 19H, get out for the early jump. Chapman runs second, then it's a three car. Fight already for third with Smith, Herzog, and McNabb. So with two laps, it'll be 19H, still your leader. Chapin, Smith, Herzog, and McNabb, your top five. White flag, one lap remaining. We'll see for a second as Smith takes it hard into turns three and four. The 17S dives low on the inside of Champin. Rounding out the turn and Smith. Able to take second away from Champin. We're checkered, yellow and checkered. I need the top four into the tech area. Got one and There's seven over on the top of the two. Here to go to the 14M of McNabb. 9H Herzog runs fourth. The zero of Chapman runs third. 17S of Smith sneaks in there for a second place finish. And a win again. Bonnie Honus in the 19H in your D 